Hello, my name is Allison Callender, and I'm the Curator of Art and Art History at the Barbados Museum and Historical Society. It gives me great pleasure to welcome you to our first art exhibition for 2021, Atlantic Rhapsody. It features over 40 works from Robert McLeod. Hi, my name is Taya Manning, and I am a research intern who's been working at the Barbados Museum for the past five months, actively on the production of the Robert McLeod um, exhibition. Here behind me, we have the section that pertains to heritage, and this section really discusses and highlights and underscores um, Robert McLeod's recognition of his responsibility as a landscape artist beyond documenting the physical landscape of the West Indies, but also documenting the social landscape of the West Indies. So behind me, you can see figures, female figures that tend to stay within the house because domesticity is something that he approaches and responds to as being a 20th century archetype of West Indian society. But we also see him responding to the progression of West Indian society with his um, production of Island Girl, which is, which is something that he doesn't, portraiture is something that he doesn't really venture into. Um, this painting really stands as a jarring contrast to the other ones where female figures are approached because unlike these paintings where these are just female figures, faceless, you know, no expressions, this is a woman standing in a very empowered stance looking towards what can't be seen in the frame. And then he also continues by documenting West Indian society, post-emancipation post um, West Indian society, and you can see women occupying spaces that their ancestors would have been um, subjected to enslavement in, but as free people that can roam and move independently and as autonomous figures. We hope to see you either physically or virtually to see this wonderful exhibition of paintings.